Zion National Park is located in southwest Utah. It is part of the Colorado Plateau. Over millions of years, this entire area rose up over 10,000 feet. These 240,000 square miles not only give us amazing natural wonders, they also provide a wealth of opportunities to study our past. Zion looked a great deal different 10,000 years ago when the first humans arrived. The Pueblo culture began about 300 BCE. Many dwellings still survive. About 1,000 years ago, the Paiute people arrived in the area. Then, in 1858, a group of Mormons migrated from Salt Lake City. The most recent visitors began arriving in 1920. Zion Lodge was built in 1924. Motor coaches transported guests into the park. Others drove themselves so they could visit at their own pace. Fall is a great time to visit. The trees are colorful and a late season snowfall is possible. Waterfalls can be found in many areas of Zion National Park. The falls at the Temple of Sinawava can easily be viewed from the road.
This is Emerald Pool and Falls. They are an easy one mile round trip walk. Hiking is a great way to experience Zion. The trails range from easy to very difficult. The Zion shuttle makes several stops along the Canyon Scenic Drive. Traffic is a problem at most national parks. Zion alleviates this with the fleet of air-conditioned shuttles. They are a far cry from those used in 1930. The shuttles leave the visitor center every six to 10 minutes. Drivers explain the many features of Zion while riders are free to relax and enjoy the scenery. A favorite stop is Zion Lodge. Located in the heart of the park, it is a great spot to sit and relax. It also offers a variety of foods and snacks. The original lodge was operated by the Union Pacific Railroad. It also offered private cabins. Activities included a swimming pool, horseback riding, and bus tours to various scenic spots. A relaxing walk along the Virgin River is a must for even a short visit. Allow at least two days to fully appreciate the wonders of Zion National Park.